Yes, yeah, Stacy, John, two people were killed in Springfield in less than a 24 hour period. One victim, a pregnant woman, the other a former high school football player. Police say the shooting death of 19 year old Andre Booker last night was likely gang retaliation to the shooting death of 28 year old Sheena Malone Tuesday night. Many in the community are concerned after a week of violence. What happened on yesterday, the incident took place on the east side and it traveled to the west side. People were terrified. There has been a sharp spike in gun violence this year compared to last. Springfield police say rival gangs have a lot to do with that. The police department is trying new tactics to curb the violence. We're doing a mix of traditional and non-traditional policing. Uh, so, you know, you may see more directed patrols or enhanced presence under the traditional stuff. You may see some undercover things we're doing. Chief Winslow says many of this year's shootings are gang related. He says it's important for parents to make sure they know who their kids are hanging out with. Because if you're not, you're putting yourself at risk. And as parents, we need to know that about our children. We need to engage our children. We need to be parents to our children. With more than 20 people hit by gunfire and five shooting deaths this year alone, Mayor Langfelder says the city is working closely with the police department to get the bad guys off the street. He to have all the resources needed financially with regards to overtime or a higher back, things of that nature. So that's what uh, we gave him to do. That's one aspect. The other aspect is what can we do as a community to make sure there's summer youth programs to protect our youth. They're our future. Four men were arrested yesterday in connection with Andre Booker's shooting death. A fifth teenage boy was taken to juvenile detention. A suspect has not been identified in the shooting death of Sheena Malone.